All right, so for those of you that don't really know the details of what happened, Andre Ferguson disrespected my fiance, my family, by speaking about her on his live Instagram. And not only that, two weeks ago, he made some statements as well about me on his page. And he continued to do so. So I addressed him yesterday, okay? He didn't like what I had to say. We went back and forth. I got angry. I drank a lot. Don't do drugs, you guys. Wasn't on drugs. Definitely was drinking. Very angry. I was very angry. I'm still very angry. Nobody disrespects my family. Nobody disrespects my fiance. Nobody disrespects my unborn daughter. Ever. It's unacceptable. If anybody of you, any one of you that are okay with that, <laughs> you guys gotta look at yourself in the mirror because you ain't a man. I did, I reacted out of anger because of the disrespect that was brought upon my fiance. And if you guys got a problem with that, then I'm okay with that. So I'm getting DMs, you know, I've, I've, I haven't watched any Andre stories. I don't even follow that fool, but I get screenshots re recorded to me and whatever. So he's playing out on this, you know, I'm crazy. Yeah, I, I was crazy last night. Very crazy. I have a temper, everybody knows that. But you guys, what you guys don't know is the past two weeks, Andre's been poking the bear. Started two weeks ago, talking shit on his stories, personal shit. I didn't, I held my tongue. I didn't say anything on social media. You guys knew that. I, I handle like a man. I call him, which he doesn't answer any fucking phone calls. I text message him, which he very rarely, he did, up until the day, he finally fucking texts me back, you know? And it's again, just him trying to twist everything on me. Realize that you guys, is these people are gonna try and twist everything on me to make me look like a fucking nut job. And they do a good damn good job of it. Good job. What it comes down to is this was a, a competitive rivalry at first. A competitive rivalry, talking a little shit between us about stage talk. And Andre had to cross the line and start talking about my fiance. So you guys can take whatever side you want. But if you guys are taking the other side, then pff, I don't want you on my side.